Hello! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a get to know me video so y'all can get to know me better. This video might be a little cringy, so prepare yourself for that. To begin, I have grown up in the Bay Area my whole life. That's where I'm at right now. That's where I am living with my parents. I'm 22 years old and I have one older sister. I'm a recent college grad, the class of COVID, um, and reminding myself that um, eventually it may, will, will it get better? Also, if anyone knows what to do with this, please let me know. I would love some input. Literally two years ago, I wanted to go to LA and pursue filmmaking um, as a career in Hollywood. And I even did an internship in LA for like two to three months. Obviously, I'm not doing that anymore, but it's still a passion of mine. And I've realized that the industry just isn't for me. It's very, it's very difficult to make it unless you um, can climb your way up through nepotism. <laughs> Now I've shifted my interests into um, hopefully one day working at a branding or creative agency and that is my ultimate goal, hence the design videos I'm posting and um, that's kind of the topic of my channel and the niche I want to focus on. Um, so you'll be seeing a lot of design stuff from me from now on. If you're interested in you know, um, following that content, please subscribe. is London. I also have a 50 minute YouTube video that I posted um, I recently about my experience when, uh, there that you can watch. I went abroad um, and I highly recommend it. I, I am terrible at directions so uh, I would probably end up in a literal ditch without Google Maps. So my favorite television show of all time is Breaking Bad. If you haven't seen it, what have you been doing? Literally just stop watching this video and go watch the show now. Um, it is highly addicting. Um, <laughs> some of the best character writing I've ever seen, um, some of the best television writing I've ever seen in general. What makes it so crazy is that he conceptualized this story um, literally without references. So you know how a lot of like shows like The Walking Dead is based on a comic or Game of Thrones is based on a novel series? Um, well this is not based on anything. In fact, um, I believe the story is that he was having a just a hypothetical conversation about what would happen if someone took an RV and just started cooking meth in the middle of nowhere and he took that um, nugget and transformed it into a multiple Emmy winning show. What shall we use to conduct this beautiful current with? Hmm? What one particular element comes to mind? Hmm? Hmm? Uh, a wire. Fun fact, actually really, really sad fact. I can't swim. Um, I'm like 85% sure that I lived across um, Richard Madden when I lived in London because one time I saw a guy cross the street and I was like, oh, he looks a lot like um, Rob Stark from Game of Thrones. And later it was confirmed by one of my housemates that he does in fact live in this area. So basically I made eye contact with Richard Madden. I have a Stafford Triple Terrier mix that we adopted two years ago. His name's Romeo. I have an Instagram for him if any of y'all are interested. Um, he's insane. I also have a chinchilla. I will insert a picture somewhere here. I can type the alphabet in 2.04 seconds. I thought I would talk about my favorite directors, um, and I'm just gonna name drop some of them. Denis Villeneuve. Denis Villeneuve. Damien Chazelle. Lee Chang Dong. 
Greta Gerwig, Barry Jenkins, and David Fincher are just a handful of my favorites. There are my favorite movies, which I will insert here. Um, Lady Bird, love that movie. Um, Moonlight, classic. Burning, great South Korean film, highly recommend. Very underrated. Whiplash. I'm quite addicted to notebooks and journals. So I have a lot of notebooks. Um, so I got a oh my god I cannot pronounce this god it's like a German brand it's a it's a Lutrum a Lut Leuchtturm <sighs> okay that's just embarrassing I'm just not gonna put that in I used to be addicted to like parking games. If anyone is old enough that's watching this who has played addicting games, I used to love the ones where you just park. I didn't like the racing ones, just where you park into different parking spots and you have to like maneuver the car and not hit anything. This book. Um, it is called Excellent Sheep. The Miseducation of the American Late, and um, I'm not going to pronounce his last name either. Well, this video makes me sound really illiterate. I promise mm. you I am literate. I just don't know how to pronounce these uh, last names. I highly recommend this to anyone who is applying to colleges, um, if, or if you're in high school, you know, um, I think it's a really great read. I think if you're a teacher or professor, you should read this as well. I didn't play any sports in high school, but I did play piano for 10 years, as every Asian child is forced to do. Literally have never played this. Actually, well, um, I have played it. I just don't know how. And uh, so I'm not gonna try that. But anyways, this is my guitar. Um, one of my favorite colors, actually this is, this is my favorite color, and I'll put it on the screen. I'm sorry if you're colorblind. Um, but it's baby blue and it's this very specific shade of baby blue so the only way I can show you is to uh, put it on the screen and maybe I'll put the hex code um, also I made a little montage for my friends because they're very important to me in my life and I would not be who I am without them so cue the montage <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I will be posting another design video very, very soon. So stay tuned and I will see you very soon. Here, okay? Just like that? That's good. Fine. Ah. Um, out, down, to the counter side, and then like this.